Don't mind if I do. Hey, the sun's past the yard arm somewhere, as my dad used to say. Look at this beautiful food here. Oh my goodness, it is going to be a happy Thursday. And happy Thursday, everyone. I'm Mike Osterhage. Fiona is off today. And we are starting with the perfect little neighborhood place to grab some meat or have a cold one. It is called the Ice House. And joining us today is Ken Oliver, who is the owner and operator of the Dakota East Side Ice House. Welcome, sir. How are you? I'm doing great. Thanks okay. for having me. What are we? What am I making right now? There's a lot of smoke. Well, you're making one of our, our uh, house favorites, which is our pork queso. Okay. What you're doing right now is you're browning up some uh, uh, pork sausage. This is our own uh, blend of pork sausage that we make, but you, if you were making this at home, you could use your own uh, favorite pork sausage of whatever kind what, you like. What's your secret? Because you've been making this for how many years? Uh, about 25 years. Oh, yeah? And then how much of this? <laughs> uh, you can put the majority of that. All right. There we go. There you go. Okay, and this is one of the favorite. And this is just a salsa. This is our house salsa. It could be any any salsa, but um, ours is a, is a, a very simple tomatoes, uh, jalapenos, onions, and then what kind of cheese? This is cream cheese. So unlike oh, wow. a lot of the quesos, uh, it's a cream cheese base. So that's different. Uh, here in San Antonio, for sure. I love. I mean, a lot of people just stick to bagels for cream cheese, but man, it goes with anything. It so, goes with anything. So right. once again, the the classic ice house, which is pretty much unique to to Texas, right? Well, to Texas and to South Texas in particular, just because of you know, at the, at the turn of the century, San Antonio had three ice making uh, plants. There was only five in the entire country, so three of them were here. So we were a center really? for ice, which is pretty hard to believe, as hot as it is in the summers. But um, they would ship ice from all, all over from here in San Antonio. And so in the city, all the neighborhoods had their own ice house, their own spot to go pick up their big blocks of ice. Mm -hmm. um, actually, our kitchen right now is in one of those original ice houses from the, from the 20s. Um, but what happened once uh, you know, refrigeration came around is, is they had to kind of change gears and kind of went more to having you know, foodstuffs and eggs and milk and beer. And then eventually... Then grocery stores... Took grocery that? stores took that even more over, and then just be just so what was more left? of a beer, beer, beer and snacks. And, you know. And the thing is, though, like you said, it is the neighborhood little spot. It's not like you have to go to a right. restaurant, go to a bar. It's just the place. It's the place, right? Okay. You go sit sit in the shade and and uh, relax a little bit, get to know your neighbors. So why is Ice House Week so important? Um, right. I think it's just really important just to help uh, preserve that culture. You know, it's something that until just recently was kind of disappearing in San Antonio even. Um, a lot of the, of the older, you know, mom and pop places were starting to disappear. Mm -hmm. um, I think COVID kind of gave a, a, a bump to some of those because, you know, so many places, people were looking for outdoor places. And so um, just, to, just to spotlight those places during Ice House Week, even the ones who are, who are off the beaten path, you know, just to get people out there and, and uh, enjoying that something unique San Antonio culture. And besides a good cold one, which... Okay, you know, maybe it's, yeah. it's 1 o'clock, that's okay. Uh, some great food here, so let's start down at, uh, which end do we want to start at, Ted? Down here, what is that sandwich? That looks so this is our delicious. spicy chicken sandwich. Mm -hmm. It's a, a breaded and fried uh, chicken breast uh, with a, kind of our take of a non-Nashville hot sauce um, with a great um, slaw there on the bottom. Mm -hmm. And then under, next to it is our uh, brisket tacos. We do all of our brisket uh, in-house, uh, smoked there in-house. Um, with the chipotle cream and, and pickled onions, jalapenos, and cotija. Definitely one of our favorites at the Ice House. And, and then right this there is what we're making right now. This is the queso we're making. Taste mine, see how, how it's See how yours is turning out. It's going to be really, really hot. <laughs> Good recipe. I love the cream cheese in there. It's and a lot then, different than people realize it's going to be. Yeah. Mm, really good. And then, last but not least, pizza. That's our brisket pizza, and we do all the same thing. We do all of our pizzas in house. We do uh, we have a pizza oven. We do the, the dough. Um, our, our our cook there, Gennaro, does uh, some really great dough. I think we have some of the best in, in town. Really great. Now, um, you also being in the neighborhood and being a neighbor, mm -hmm. help out your neighbors a lot too, right? We try to do all all that we can. You know, we've organized street cleanups. We have a food pantry. Um, I think I mentioned to you earlier, you know, we try and invite uh, nonprofits or any, any community organization who's looking for a spot. We try to always have that open for them. Okay, that's absolutely wonderful. And you have some of the deals going on right now as well, too. We do. Ice House we Week. do. So all the different uh, participants of Ice House Week have different specials. Um, ours in particular is uh, noon to six every day is a dollar off draft beers. And from three to six is five dollars off buckets. 
Oh. So that's a good one. Get there between three and six. So yeah. We, so we, get, we can leave after the show. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And then grab a bucket. And where are you located again? 433 South Hackberry. We're about five blocks from the Alamo Dome. Okay. Wonderful. And there's more than about, what, 30 ice houses participating in this? There's 32, okay. I think, this year, but there's way more than that that are in the city. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Well, if you'd like more information on Dakota East Ice House, of course, head over to SALive.com. Click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. We have provided a link or just scan that QR code right down there at the bottom of your screen. All right. Celebrate San Antonio with us on YouTube. Yeah, all of your favorite DIY videos, food, drinks, tips, and tricks. If you've seen it here, it's on the SA Live YouTube channel. Just search KSAT SA Live on YouTube and like, subscribe, and ring the bell.